Hey everybody, what's going on? Uh, I'm at my parents' house. See? You know what, I make fun of it, but this photo uh, won the photographer some award or something, and I was in the paper. Anyway, uh, I think I already did a vlog on this guy. But this is my first electric guitar. That my dad bought me on his birthday, like when I was 13, 13 maybe? I think they're, yeah, 12 or 13. So this guy is old. She may be old as dirt, but uh, it still plays unbelievably. I don't get, I like, I don't understand why it still plays as well as it does. It's always in tune. It sits up here at my parents. This is the only guitar that I, I left at my parents' house, and uh, it just sits here untouched until I come to visit and I always pick it up but the thing plays so great All my other strats are so fussy and so finicky. Like when the the seasons change, I need to adjust the necks and like redo the intonation. It's so much work. This guy just sits here and is always working. It, she's missing the input jack because I, I Frankensteined it. I've taken parts over, taken parts from it over the years. But like it's got two springs. And that's not correct. And like it's all set up incorrect. Look at the. Freaking saddles. This one doesn't even match. It's like a random one that I found. I just don't understand. I've done everything to this guitar that you shouldn't do to a guitar. And, uh, she still plays, man. Like, um, like these machine heads, they don't fit correctly. Look at that. They're not even designed for this guitar. These came off of uh, a 1997 Stevie Ray Vaughan Strat that someone gave me. I'm like, oh shit, I'm going to put them on my guitar. <laughs> and uh, they totally don't fit. They're all crooked with weird screws that I could like put together before I knew anything about how to take care of my stuff. You know? It's all chipped around the nut. He probably, I probably came. It's all chipped around the nut. And this is a weird, uh, this isn't even the original nut. It's like a, it's like a replacement nut that I stuck in there and tried to cut. It still plays the shit, man. The neck is still super, it's super straight. It just sits here. I don't get it. Don't get it. I wish all my other strats were this easy to take care of. And, I mean, no maintenance. I was so psyched to get this thing. I, I don't know, it's just, it was so cool. Like I've taken it apart so many times. I've taken the neck off a thousand times. It's never been set up, it's never been intonated. Um, she just continues to work. This vlog's about nothing, I'm just, uh, now I know I think I've already talked about this guy before. It's just every time I, I come up and pick it up, it's, I'm just amazed by it. Brings back fond memories of me, uh, 
standing in the living room here, watching Stevie Ray Vaughan DVDs and uh, playing along, wearing my cowboy hat. Anyway, no point to this vlog other than me rambling about how cool this old guitar is, so uh, I'll see you guys later.